Well, what kind of cake should you get? How can you save money in that wedding dress? How do you entertain guests? What kind of flowers should you get? If you're planning your wedding, you've probably been thinking about all those questions and much more. Answers can be found at the Hawaii Bridal Expo this weekend. Brad Buckles, producer of Brides Club, and Jill Easley with Easley Designs. Join us now with a preview. Good morning. Welcome back. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. Nice seeing you. Nice spread. But Thank first you. of all, what can people expect? at the expo this weekend. Now we have about 170 different companies that are coming down to help you plan your wedding. First and foremost, it's all about the bride. It is all about the bride. Thank you for saying that. Yep. And what is your suggestion for the bride, first of all, in going to the expo? Don't go alone. Don't go alone. And you really want to bring the friends that want to be there with you, not the ones that are going to distract and like want to go or, hey, I need to go get coffee, but bring the ones that are going to really help you pick the things you want, interested in your day, make you feel comfortable and secure about some of the decisions you got to bring the A-team. Bring your A-team, bring the girls. Okay, so what are some of the latest tips and treadings in weddings nowadays? Jill, you've got the, you've got yes. all the accessories here. So for bridal bouquets, 80s style is back in again. Our big cascading, almost whimsical mm -hmm. type of bouquet. This almost looks like a centerpiece, but you said it's it the bridal no, bouquet. No, it's the bridal okay. bouquet. Here, hold it so oh you can goodness. see. Okay. So it's not so heavy. <laughs> the bow on the <laughs> back, the nice little touch. Oh, right. I got it. So okay. this is your main focal point in all of your photos. Mm -hmm. So this is really in right now. Um, just as big as you can get it. Okay. Back in the 80s, everything was big. So. Right. This is like the wedding singer. This I is like the this, wedding right? singer, yes, okay, exactly. So big, vertical, long bridal bouquet. Right. What else uh, about um, wedding pieces? Centerpieces are a little bit more elegant and simplistic. So, mm -hmm. you know, you'll have your very simple flowers. We have little embellishments here that not only go on your centerpieces and on your tables, but also like in your bouquet as well. So you could have a little brooch such as this one here and you could take the brooch and place it oh. right there. So that brings in just a little bling and elegance into, you know, your outdoor type of uh, foliage bouquet. You and could tie that into like having the mother of the bride wear one or right. father, something so fun like a, that. So just a, a boutonniere pin like this Got too. It. So it kind of ties it all in with a lot of elegance. Of course, candles always, but if you're in that outdoor setting, mm -hmm. then we'll do like LEDs. And then everything from up above is really in too now. So like those big created chandeliers. Okay. Brad has some of these circles here. You would hang them at different different sizes. Mm -hmm. And then you would put maybe some garland on each one with a simple flower. And they would be hanging from the tent. So everywhere you look, it's almost like certain things are are a different decor everywhere. So it's kind of a make your own chandelier. It is a, a make your own chandelier, but a lot of our bride and grooms now, life is so busy, nobody wants to have to do it themselves. So they come to the experts to do that. Okay, the big question is how can people save money? How can brides save money at their wedding? It's interesting because a lot of brides do the DIY thing thinking they're going to save money mm -hmm. to only have it not look the way they wanted and then have to go back and hire a wedding professional and fix it like the week of. And right. it'll cost even more. Uh, always, always. Okay. So and the we key see is, that happen so often too. So the key is talk with somebody, get some ideas. Maybe they'll help you get set up on some DIY projects that you can do and then they can help you. So you have some fun of doing some of the craftiness or some of the accessories yourself, but in conjunction with them guiding you with what they do best, decor, maybe bouquets or whatever. Right. My favorite story is one of the brides that wanted to hand tie her bouquet herself because she thought hand tying would be so easy until she took all the flowers, put them together, hand tied it, and all the heads of the flowers popped off Okay. the night before the wedding. And there's a lot behind the scenes that you don't know about, so. All right, so for more on the Hawaii Bridal Expo, Again, it is this weekend, if yep. you're interested. It's Friday from 5.30 to 9 p.m., then on Saturday and Sunday from 9.30 to 3. Regular admission is $10. And again, Brad and Jill, thank you so much for stopping no, by and giving for, for tips us. and letting us know 80s is back. It's 80s back. is back. All right, thanks a lot.